y'all. If you're new and if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. Hey, you guys. Um, it is Sunday morning and had a great time last night at my uh, job's holiday party. It was a good time. I don't know how I survived considering how little sleep I got, but I had a great time. Now, um, me and my man are heading over to my parents' house to um, just sit and visit, maybe drink a little coffee, maybe eat a little breakfast before he gets back on the road to head home. So yeah, y'all, that's what's going on right now. It is cold here. Now, the way I gauge temperature, if it's anything below 55, it's cold to me, okay? Now, preferably, I want it to be 60 and up at all times, but you know, I don't have that kind of pool yet. So, it's cold, it's like 46 degrees. So I'm trying to think what the heck I'm gonna cook for dinner considering the time I don't know if it would be a good idea to even try to put something in the uh, the crock pot like some beans with some turkey legs or some beans with some turkey wings or I don't know I'm thinking about it but I will check in with you guys later I'm not sure if it'll be when I get to my parents house or what but you will see me again so I'll talk to y'all soon Steaming hot. Well, she said it was cold. But grandma is chewy. That's like Mexican Applebee's. Yeah. Yeah. And you feel it on this side? And I'm not on, just the No, it's on the other side. But it was tough. Other side. Baby. Oh, okay, I see. Yeah. It was terrible house. Oh, look how he. Don't be giving him them eyes. It ain't gonna work. He is okay. Yeah. And she was young. When she was young, nice. she had this, she looked like. Yeah, she might go back and give her the cook the eye, like, yeah, hook this one up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Because she wasn't. That's the ground meat. You, some yeah, of these young know. people, they're okay, but you could tell okay. she didn't really want to work. Right. I mean, she was cordial, but she was not your mm -hmm. Good boy. genuine, yeah, authentic, COVID, friendly person. She was giving person. everybody them checks and stuff to hey, stay buddy. home. People don't want to work anymore. Sit still. Yeah. 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 His face, Lord, if we could just get that face straight. What's wrong with his face? You know, his hair like this in the morning. I gotta wet it. Mommy, like, he's a dog. No, but he looks horrible. No, he doesn't. With his hair off. My mom, like Dylan will go outside with my mom, like while she's doing in the garden, and before she lets him back in the house, you gotta get a bath. You He's, he's that. Because he's going to live here. He's got to smell good. The, the, the. Don't make sense to me. Not a basic ain't no hard to name. Stay blue, we going to get high. How big is it? Feeling like that's nine. She's bigger than Dylan. Yeah. But you but just. But she still don't need a lot. She's just, she's no. my ass. And just. My just, dog is a pit bull, but don't know she's a pit bull. She don't know she's a pit bull. She thinks she's a chihuahua. Really? That's a, that's dog, remarkable. My dog is strictly, they get a bad rap. She's a hundred, I know, she's a hundred percent? Well, I don't know. I got oh, it from her. She might be. <laughs> she might be. She might have a little angle in her. Mostly everything, huh? That's buddy. 70 years? How many years is that? In, uh, Seven. 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 Dog years is what, seven years to a year? Mm-hmm. So. Dylan is how six. Is okay. Dylan six Dylan or seven? Dylan was born in 2016. He'll be eight. He'll be eight coming up, right? So he's. You 49? He'll be eight coming up. <laughs> he's 49. You 49, damn it! That's what I'm saying. March 2013. He was born in March. No, May. Because we bought him home. Dylan, you 49. May 3rd. I'm like, okay. It's crazy how they 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 be so old, but then they still have all that energy. I used to be terrified of dogs until my sophomore year of high school when my mom brought him home. Well, I had stepped on him and he snipped at my foot. He didn't exactly bite her. 
But I used to walk around the house with my pants because I didn't. I was scared of dogs, so I didn't want him to touch me. Anything. Liquor. Oh my god. And then we became the best of friends. I know. And then we got Dilly. They cracking easy over there. Then we got Dill Dill. Hey y'all, I'm back. Y'all, I'm so tired. <laughs> so tired. <laughs> Oh my God, I'm so tired because there's no such thing as catching up on sleep. And I barely got any sleep on what, Friday night, Saturday morning. So I'm tired y'all. But I wanted to bring up, um, y'all know that my daughters have camp, my daughters, Cammie and Kyra have sickle cell disease and They've been in a few articles in the New York Times um, regarding different things with them having sickle cell disease. Um, and most recently on Friday, was it Friday? Yeah, Friday, I was getting all these text messages from people because the FDA has officially approved two different gene therapy treatments that have been proven to cure sickle cell disease, which is amazing. It's phenomenal for so many reasons. Um, and again, it brings hope. And we need hope. The sickle cell community needs hope. So this is huge news. So thank you to all my friends and family who were reaching out on Friday, who, whether they saw it on a newspaper article, I think CNN did a special, like a bunch of different news outlets did specials on it. So, um, I'm curious to see what happens now because, okay, yes, it just got approved by the FDA, but now the issue comes with insurance, medical insurance. Are medical insurance is gonna cover this? If they're gonna cover it, how much are they gonna cover for? What will their requirements be in order to approve people? for the procedure and if they if someone doesn't qualify how much is that going to cost and is it going to be something that's going to be accessible to the masses because although sickle cell disease is not a black african american african it's not a black illness a large percentage of the people who have sickle cell disease are either african american or african descent or somewhere down the line, there is that type of um, lineage. But there's also people from Mexico and different areas in South America that are also influenced by African culture who also have sickle cell disease, um, people from with Mediterranean descent. There's just a wide, 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 wide range of people who are affected by sickle cell disease. Um, so yeah, you guys, it's gonna be, very interesting to see what happens next. The Cammy and Kyra and I have had, we have lots of open conversations and I know for sure Kyra is more, uh, Kyra is ahead of Cammy and her certainty of her desire to want this procedure or not. Cammy is still like, I'm gonna sit back and see how it goes. So we'll see. Um, um, it, it's kind of it's great but at the same time just being completely transparent and honest it's also sucks that the people of the sickle cell community already suffer so much and the only way to get on the other side of that suffering is to go through something even I don't want to say even worse but the pr the process to get the gene therapy is is intense it's, it's very intense and of course, in life, there are no guarantees. So there's a lot at stake. Um, there's a lot more to come, I'm sure, but there's hope and that that's amazing. So we'll see how it goes, you guys. Praying, praying, praying. But anyways, I may, it's like the temperatures are dropping here in San Antonio, not like significantly, but like the highs are in the like mid to low 60s. The lows are in like the mid to high 30s, high 40s. And I wanted to make me a pot of beans. So I put me some pinto beans with some turkey mix um, in my crock pot. 
and that's make cooking and i just took some cornbread out the oven so y'all i'm about to relax because i gotta go to work in the morning and i'm tired i also have another client whose due date is actually on the 14th which is in like five four five days so your girl needs to get replenished and get my life together because any day now we've got another baby coming so i will check in with you guys tomorrow I pray that you guys are well and at peace, and that's it. All right, peace and love, you guys.